Hi everyone and welcome to my place. I want to show you how to embellish an outfit. For a year, for a deer, I wore black and I'm very much over black now, but I've got, and I've got, as a result of that little deer, I have a no, I've got all these black frocks and I now want to do something to enhance them. So what I want to share with you now is how to get an iron-on transfer, these are the two that I've selected, and they come in lots and lots and lots of different um, patterns and this is a, or designs, so this is a Simcoe one that I picked up there, I think they're about, I don't know, three or four dollars. Um, I thought that I could either do that with the flowers or I could do that and I'm actually thinking I might like to do this because I'm going to a friend's wedding very soon and you know she's all into scales and all the rest of it you know Mexican year of the dead etc etc so I'm going to use that now I've found that it works best if it's a cotton or a linen blend as opposed to something that is a knit you need an iron set to high but all of your instructions are on the back so it's pretty much just going to be place patch face up face up means looking at you um, cover with fabric or teflon i'm going to use a little bit of parchment paper and then it says iron on high heat at 150 to 160 for three to ten seconds with a bit of force applied to it so here is my frock and i think i want to put my transfer, how do I get into this? I want to put my transfer about there. So there is my transfer. Let me just bring that out very carefully, getting rid of that. There it is, and it's all ready to go. And there is the that there has sort of like a little bit of a stickiness on it. Now I'm just going to give this a little bit of an iron to make sure that there are no wrinkles in it. And there's my facing there. So I'm going to put it about there. You could do this for jackets, you could use it on t-shirts. I've done it onto the face of a cushion. Now they said with fa facing, so I'm going to put that there, and I can now decide which way I want. It. Do I want it on an angle or do I want it like that? I think I want it like that. And I want to come down from where my facing is. So I'm going to put that there. You can put it on the back of the front, but I think that that would be nice for now. To protect it, they said to use a little bit of Teflon or fabric. I'm going to use the baking paper. And I just want to make sure that I am. So hold on, I'm just going to move that up a bit to make sure that it is on my ironing surface. Smooth that down and put that on top of it. Other, um, iron set to 150, 160, and it's just a matter of applying a little bit of brute force. Please work. And they said it takes, what they say, three to 10 seconds, and I would say that that will depend on the heat of your iron. And you don't want to have it too hot, because if you've got it too hot, you'll actually end up by melting everything. And then I'll just go, holding that down there, and just go up to the top here. I hope I've done this right, because I couldn't stand for it to be a mistake, because I don't think I know how to get it off if I do make a mistake. Keep going, keep going, keep going. And the, in due course, let me just see what happens. Are we on? Where's my glasses? Let me just check. And then they said you just peel off. Oh, no, it's not quite yet. Not quite, everybody. Because the image is actually between the plastic and that actually has to go down on to the fabric. Let me just see how we're going here. And what is happening? Aha, it's starting to come now. Has it come off yet? Oh, it has, it has, it has. It's a beautiful magic moment here at Astor's place. Look at that. Oh, it's worked. It's, oh, that bit there hasn't quite worked. So I'm just going to put the iron down to make sure that all of it has transferred onto the fabric. And it has, oh my goodness, it's a magic moment. Look, oh, oh, there's a bit that's not done. So you're just going to have to check as you go, because they did say to apply pressure, didn't they? They did. Just keep going. Yeah. 
Okay, so here we go, rolling off the backing paper and some of those little bits, those little fine bits, just didn't quite come off as I anticipated. There's another bit there, but they are quite fine. But never mind, that will be, f it doesn't matter because they'll be just fine. Oh, look at that. That's perfect. And now I'm just going to gently put the iron over that. And there we have a transferring of an image onto a frock. Oh, I love it. I love it and I think it just looks beautiful. Now when you are laundering, you can wash it, you can do anything with it, but when you are ironing, just be careful that you don't put any heat on that because it will get stuck to the face of your iron. But And now I, as I look at that, I think, hmm, I might just be able to do a little bit of, of um, further embellishing with a few little Swarovski crystals, I think. So I now love a very plain outfit that can be worn and looks like it's something new and different. I hope you've enjoyed that. I've enjoyed sharing it with you and I look forward to seeing you all again another day. Thank you.